I'm gonna show you how to quickly make a screen record as a GIF. I use this often to send to people as an accompanying visual to give instructions, highlight steps to take, and so much more. It is so much more exciting than sending a screenshot. On this channel, I talk a lot about practical advice to look good online. Consider subscribing for more videos just like this one. If these topics interest you, hit that bell to be notified when I post next. Now it's time to show you how to make a screen record as a GIF. Now I mentioned a second ago why you might want to do a screen record as a GIF. Maybe you're going through certain instructions or you wanting to provide some visuals beyond just a screenshot. I'm going to show you the best tool to be able to do that today, whether you're using a Mac like me or you're on a Windows computer. This tool is not dependent on a browser either, which is something I like. You install it directly to your computer and it's called Record It One Word. I'm showing you their website here, nice and simple. You go here recordit.co to download for Mac and for Windows depending on what you're using. Now before I actually go and start my screen record I'm going to show you in this instance I'm going to be providing a screen record to a client in an email to show them how to update their billing information. So when I'm on the screen that I want to record I'm going to go ahead after this is installed in your uh, on your computer it'll display this little icon in your toolbar up at the top at least for Mac users. Windows will be something similar. Now you may want to take just a quick peruse at the settings before you do your first one. There are general settings, very simple here if you want it to launch on login, highlight mouse color, etc. as well as password protection if you want it and the shortcut you can uh, adjust the settings there. So I'm going to go ahead and close that. I'm going to go ahead and click this icon up here and basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit record. It's going to allow me to draw on the screen what area I want to record. If I just click, it will record the whole screen. In this case, I'm going to record just this window for my client. So here we go. Once you've drawn it, it will say that when you're ready to record, you just hit that little icon again, which is now filled in red. So I'm going to do that. And then now with my mouse I'm being recorded, I'm going to move fairly slow so that my client can take it all in. Boom. I'm not going to click that because it shows my credit card details and I'm not going to put that on YouTube. But that's the general idea. And then when you're done recording, click stop up in the corner, or up on the top rather. And it will take just a second Right, it'll take, depending on how long the video is, the free version of Record It will allow you to record up to five minutes, but boom, just that fast, it's already given me a hyperlink that I can click there and a notification to download this. Now, because this was a quick one, it's already converted it as a GIF or a GIF, however you pronounce it, I can drag that onto my desktop and include it in an email. If it's longer, sometimes it will save it as a movie file, but then in the bottom uh, bottom right, you would just click there to convert that to a GIF or a GIF, however you pronounce it. So that's pretty much it. That's how it works. Here's how my finished GIF looks. And again, the tool is called Record It, one word, and it's a free download for Windows or Mac. I love this tool. I'll link to it in the description below. I hope this tutorial helps, and if you have any other lingering questions, feel free to comment below. I keep an eye on those personally. If you found this video helpful, I would really appreciate a like, and consider subscribing for more of my videos here on YouTube, where I discuss branding, websites, and social media, always practical advice to look good online. I'm Phil Palin, thanks for watching, and next I'm linking through to some videos I think you'll find helpful. Those are coming up next.